vlog and maybe you recognize this background from previous week because right now I'm in Mykonos but I'm actually going to travel to Santorini so this is going to be my Santorini vlog <laughs> Here you have the bathroom and oh my god, these are bathroom goals. I mean, check out this bath with the mosaic and all this marble. I'm obsessed. And I look like crap because I actually had a very, very tiring boat ride. It was like a stormy wind and I got so seasick, so can't deal with looking presentable right now. But yeah, the bathroom is very nice. Then we also have some rose gold accessories here. Oh my god. <laughs> and this is the bed. How beautiful does this look, right? And it gets even better because this is a vanity made from marble. I mean, that's pretty much my life goal for sure. <laughs> And then we have this little area, which is very cute. And then this is the view. Good morning, guys, and welcome to a new day on the Santorini vlog. And yesterday I was really, really tired due to the fact that it was our travel day. Uh, we actually traveled from Mykonos to Santorini by boat. I don't know if you know this about me, but I get the worst motion sickness ever and i already had one very bad experience on a boat in greece it was 45 minutes on a high speed boat but to see that day was so rough and i didn't throw up but i was very close to actually doing it and this time we also traveled by a high speed boat for two hours um it wasn't as bad as the previous time but it was pretty pretty bad especially at the end and i felt so sick the whole day that i didn't really want to vlog that much because i just didn't feel like it also i had some troubles with the shipment of the supply by lily orders it had to be shipped out yesterday but some things went wrong unfortunately so i definitely had a very down day yesterday and um I just want to be honest with you guys, not all my days are amazing. Yesterday I honestly just suddenly started crying because I just couldn't take all the stress and you, you may think like, oh Lilia, you're on vacation in beautiful Santorini, but um, I've just been working my ass off on uh, managing all the bookkeeping and all the orders and answering your emails and like... I don't know, I had to do so much for Supply by Lily and also because I'm moving to DC in, oh my god, less than two weeks. So yeah, it was just a little bit too much yesterday. Uh, but today is a new day, so if I look a little bit tired, that's because of yesterday. And I also only did like a little bit of foundation and brows. I'm going to finish my makeup in a bit, but... Yeah, um, I don't want to start this vlog on a negative note or something, but I just I just wanted to be straight up with you guys that not all my days are highs, I also have downs. Continue watching this vlog if you want some positive vibes after this negative crap of mine. Finally going to take a little dip in the pool. By the way, the bikini that I'm wearing is from uh, Zaful. I got it previous year wearing some shorts from Monkey and my belt from Gucci. So yeah, let's go. So right now I'm in Kira, which is one of the bigger cities in Santorini. 
and I mean a look at this stunning view behind me it's so freaking beautiful here however I do have to say I like Mykonos more than Santorini um, the view here is amazing maybe more like even more amazing than in Mykonos but the city itself is not as pretty as Mykonos so I would definitely recommend Mykonos over Santorini just saying but now we're on the lookout to find some food somewhere which is not very touristy but it's very touristy here so that's going to be quite hard Hey guys, so yeah, I'm just casually talking to you right now with the most amazing view in the back. I mean, how stunning is this, right? I just can't deal with the fact how beautiful this is. But um, yeah, we actually had quite a chill day. We're now still at Thira and tonight we're going to Kala Ma Kala something. Um, I will definitely write it here or you will hear it later when I know what it is. But um, yeah, it's like on the other side of the island. We wanted to go to Ia, I think it's called. You write Oya, but you say Ia, I think. But um, yeah, um, but schedule wise, we didn't have enough time today. So we're now going back to our hotel, Del Sol, picking up our suitcases and then traveling to our last hotel of this trip, which is very sad. I don't want to say goodbye to this view. This wouldn't be a lovely life vlog without some Fragendas! Belgian chocolate is my absolute favorite. Oh my god, I'm obsessed with this stuff. I love it. So guys, we're now at our last hotel slash apartment we're going to stay at in Santorini. This is on the other side of the island and it's called Kamari. Uh, it's called Santorini Crystal Blue Sweets and they gave us some food, very nice. Then this is the kitchenette, kind of couch, bed situation. Then this is the bathroom. It's very big. But of course, it's not as pretty as our previous hotel, so that kind of sucks. And then, no. Oh. And then here is the uh, bedroom, and this is my favorite part. So I love this vanity; I think it's very cute. And this is the bed; I think it's very beautiful. I can definitely make a cute picture here. And then this is the closet, which is very spacious, and some bathrobes. So yeah. That's the little apartment tour. It's very, very spacious. And this is me. And by the way, uh, what I'm wearing today, so I'm wearing a very simple tee from Zara. Then I'm also um, wearing some of my new necklaces and old necklaces. Let me fix this. So I got this uh, wishbone necklace at a store here, like a Greek store. Um, I think it's very pretty. Then this one is from Karma. This one is from Brandy Melville. And I also got this new circle bracelet at that same store in Santorini Thera. And I love my nails, by the way. So for my outfit, I'm wearing this white tee from Zara. My belt is from Gucci. And my shorts are tripped with Levi's. And then my shoes. My shoes are from Alexander Wang. Bag from Gucci. So yeah. That's the outfit. What are you saying? Pusa. Pusa. What? You want some fish? Yes, you want some fish. Pusa. Pusa. What do you want? 
Oh, yeah. Good morning guys, I just came out of the shower as you can see obviously and uh, I'm going to get ready now using all this stuff and I'm also washing suits. Yes, love it. So um, yeah, see you in a bit when I look presentable. So I'm done doing my makeup and my hair and I thought to do an outfit of the day of course. So the top that I'm wearing is the striped tee from a very nice cotton material. It's from a brand called Lolly's Laundry and I think it's a Scandinavian brand. Pretty cool. I think it's a very nice a basic striped top. Uh, then my shorts are from Monkey. They're my favorite shorts ever because they're high-waisted and not too short but also not too long and I don't know, I just think they're very flattering. And then my belt is from Gucci and I'm wearing the same bracelets and uh, necklaces. And then for shoes, I'm kind of debating what I'm thinking about. Let me show you. So, these ones, yes. So guys, I did a little bit of shopping and I'm going to share everything that I got um, in this vlog as well because I actually did a Greek um, pharmacy haul. Now, I have a thing for foreign pharmacies. Pharmacies in the Netherlands are very boring and like very medical I would say while if you go to France or Spain or Italy or like now Greece you have like a amazing beauty wall hala and in particular I'm in love with the brand Chorus I'm not sure if I'm pronouncing it right but I think it's kind of okay uh, I think it means girl or woman uh, in Greek and they have the best skincare products so I'm going to start off with my favorite set, which is the Wild Rose Head to Toe collection. And the Wild Rose uh, skincare line from Chorus is definitely my favorite. I tried it two years ago. I completely finished the whole uh, set that I bought back then because it was so amazing. And this is a different set because it contains the Advanced Brightening Sleeping Facial and the Japanese Rose Body Butter. Now the Body Butter I haven't tried, but the Advanced Brightening Sleeping Facial is amazing. <laughs> so this is the Advanced Brightening Sleeping Facial. I'm definitely going to use it tonight. This is the Body Butter. Then, from the same Wild Rose line, I also got the Wild Rose Brightening and Line Smoothing Serum for face and eyes. Now, I am 22, but I really believe in preventing wrinkles instead of fighting them. Now, I have here a little bit of a wrinkle going on because every time that I'm concentrated or I just look at my phone, for example, I will do this. Now, um, hopefully, something like this will work. And I like to use serums during the day instead of during the night as my day cream because I feel like day creams are a little bit too heavy for me. So I like to use a very heavy night cream and then use serums as my day cream. So when I was at Chorus, there was actually this guy working there, the pharmacist, and he was so sweet. But he actually, um, I picked up one of the shower gels in vanilla cinnamon. This is my favorite shower gel ever because it honestly smells like a very luxurious vanilla cinnamon. I actually picked up one and then he said like, no, you have to pick up this because this is one, get one free. So, of course, it has like the most amazing sales. And I'm not quite sure how expensive this was, but I think it was like 10 euros for one, so now 10 euros for two. To go with the shower gels, I also purchased the vanilla cinnamon uh, body milk. Oh, so nice. I'm going to smell myself the whole day. So then I also got a little bottle of Bioderma. I like to use this to remove my makeup, especially when I'm traveling. And last but not least, um, the pharmacist there was so nice and we got into this conversation about social media and how he was trying to do like the social media for his uh, pharmacy and then he checked out my blog and he really liked it and then he was so kind uh, to give me like five um, face masks to me and also five face masks to my mom. So these are actually the new Chorus 
Beauty Cubes, such a cute name. And what this is, this is perfect for traveling because um, these are little face masks that you can just put in your beauty bag and then you have like, oops, <laughs> they have like the perfect um, little kind of chill moment during vacation to try them out. So this is the anti-pollution raspberry, it's a jelly face mask and it's for all skin types. Then I also got the Beauty Cubes Invigorating Orange in all skin types. It's also a jelly face mask. It almost looks like honey. And then I also got the Purifying Rosemary, also for all skin masks. Skin masks? No, all skin types. Uh, it's a clay face mask. And this is the Brightening Rose Hips All Skin Types Clay Face Mask. Also very nice. Whoa, what was that sound? That was pretty scary. Um, okay, the last one is the Cooling Cucumber. It's also a jelly face mask. So I just think this is such a cute idea. So that was my little kind of skincare and body care haul. Chorus Hall. I hope you enjoyed it. Um, and now I'm going, I think, to shoot some pictures and find some food because I'm hungry. Guess we never can really be sure. And it goes in the same. It's not the same. Well, I'm just wishing we could be close. I know you have the feeling that something's changed. As long as I have enough time at the moment, but I'll hit you right back. Maybe we can save it all up for the weekend. So I'm just sitting and editing my vlog that has to go up tonight, and I'm holding a towel. <laughs> I don't know why, but um, I don't know. I suddenly had this feeling quite emotional feeling that I've been traveling so much these last couple of weeks. I mean, I've been to Paris, I've been to Marseille, now I'm in Santorini, I've been in Mykonos, and this is my last day in Santorini, and tomorrow we're leaving, and I still have a week left in Groningen, where I have to move my whole apartment, fix my visa, um, like, just say goodbye mentally and physically. And then I'm moving to Washington DC and that's it. Tomorrow will be one of my last days in Groningen. And I know I'm coming back, it's not forever that I'm going to Washington DC, but... I don't know, um, maybe it's a little bit weird, but I get homesick very easily. I love to travel, don't take me wrong. But I just feel so happy in my loved apartment in Groningen that I sometimes get homesick and I didn't have that as a child but now I do get that I don't know if any of you also have this homesickness let me know in the comments down below but I'm just kind of afraid that I won't find, you know, my, my place in DC but on the other hand I'm very excited to move to DC because I also feel like I need a change of environment so kind of mixed feelings um, but hopefully everything will turn out okay and I always have you guys that support me and by the way I hit the 140,000 subscribers today thank you so much it honestly means so much to me that 140,000 people subscribe to my channel it's ridiculous I can't even believe it and now you're all going to see my journey in Washington DC pretty crazy I don't know just curious how my life will be. Everything has changed so much these last couple of months, weeks, that I just don't know where I will be in a couple of months. So yeah, I don't know, just felt like sharing this. Not a very good story, but hopefully you enjoyed it. <laughs> um, yeah, okay, back to editing. Maybe we can save it all up for the weekend Something like that It's always I have enough time at the moment But I'll hit you right back It's so hard to be insane This distance
hello from the future um so guys before i'm going to end this vlog i actually wanted to add a part kind of a little life update because i'm posting this santorini vlog a little bit later than i usually do because so much has happened in these past couple of weeks that i felt like this vlog needed a different ending first of all i wanted to say that this is going to be the last lily like vlog for 2017 and i really hope that you enjoy watching my travel videos if you did thank you so much give this video a thumbs up it would mean a lot to me um, if you have missed a couple of them because you've been on vacation yourself I actually have a whole playlist that I'll link down below and I honestly spend so much time editing um, and filming like everything so I hope you um, enjoy watching my uh, travel videos um, with that being said, this is the last Lady Like vlog and after this I am going to continue with my DC Diaries or not continue, actually start uh, before this I always did my law school vlogs but now that I'm moving to DC I thought it would be time to kind of update that series and start a new one with the DC Diaries so I hope you're excited for that from now on I'm going to do two videos a week maybe more if I have time and every Sunday will be a vlog because I'm going to continue uh, with the weekly vlogging now I do have to say I'm not quite sure if I want to do weekly vlogs or daily vlogs or a couple of day vlogs if that makes sense let me know what you like most um, currently I've been really into the weekly vlogging but maybe I'm going to do a couple of day vlogs or maybe daily vlogs but I'll just switch them up and um, yeah I just hope you are excited for my DC diaries also next week or actually this week, yeah, this week, I'm also going to start with my back to school series. So that's very exciting. And if you're wondering, yes, I'm filming this in my new apartment in Washington, D.C. But more about that and moving vlogs will come this week. So I hope you're excited for that. Also, I just want to thank you so much for your support honestly you're the best i've been getting so many messages wishing me good luck in dc asking me if i would do an apartment tour when my apartment is done i'm definitely going to do an apartment tour for you guys i know you love my previous apartment but you will definitely not be disappointed with this one as well um don't forget to follow me on instagram because instagram stories and my snapchat i update those a lot um so yeah i'll link them down below all the links are down below also little shout outs to my um lily girl boss supplied by lily uh, facebook group i love you guys i love seeing all your um posts i know it's just so much fun so yeah if you want to be part of that community as well you get a free um like invitation or you can apply um, for um, being part of the facebook group with any supply by lily order which is my stationery line but more info about that in the subscription box subscription no description box so yeah i'm just a little bit all over the place because i'm so tired but yeah moving to a different continent does that to you so i hope you enjoyed this last lindy like vlog again give it a thumbs up if you liked it let me know what you thought of it in the comments down below don't forget to subscribe i always say that and i don't even know if it has any effect oh well so i just love you guys thank you and yeah bye